<laughs> Hello guys, we're back on the crystal thingy and today we're not gonna do much but this is, I think this is day 4, I think 5 so the weekends have passed and the sea reservoir has grown this much and I don't know what that was, wait that was oh. that's potassium dichromate it has grown a bit and the ferrous sulfate Died. The string got the string, the string was too loose. Oh god. So we're just gonna do it again. Okay, let's try. Okay, um around two weeks have passed. And we have a very nice looking crystal. Hey, hey guys! So, it has become time to clean up the crystals we have made in the beginning of the year. Woohoo! Sound effect. It has been around like two months since we have suspended into our solution. So, the CUSO4, well, that's big. It has become this big, and it was quite successful. So, therefore, I made another solution. But then, this one, the problem was that. It wasn't big no, enough. The like, wasn't just just if you have something like this on the top that doesn't look good, just break it off. Yeah. Because it will grow if you don't. So you have I've got another one like this. Well that's although it has failed a bit because you can see double layers. So it's so pretty good. So cool. And then like the what was this? I forgot. Like the thing about this was that I, I, have, I was too lazy to make yeah. another solution and, and also this one's quite expensive so I did it so it got stuck to the bottom so we so have it's pretty <laughs> yeah, it's in its own way so okay. guys if you're making something make sure you have a new solution every time or else you're gonna get can I see the bottom of it? yeah sure oh, oh. If you're gonna do a solution, choose something that's not expensive. And also, what might that be? There was a crystal. Uh, but not so sure if it's. But if like, it is, a as you can see, like, it got all white. Uh, I think CUSO4 one was the best. Yeah, he has the first break. Uh, that looks like some CUSO4 mixed with coffee. <laughs> this is not CUSO4. But I, I know, yeah. So, guys, if you're gonna do something, do something about. But like, CUS4 is a good choice. And to move on, we. Um, crystalli crystallizing process was quite a fun thing. So, we, uh, we have decided to sign off into our, one of the Korean crystalli crystallizing competition. Yeah, it's called this Crystal Contest. So, in. The 20th yeah. annual Korean uh, yeah, crystal, crystal contest. You get a free cup and a free reagent. That's your phosphate, phosphate monobase. So we're gonna be growing this for 10, 10 months or something. So I'm gonna the competition. And if you got become a fresh piece or something, you get a hundred models. That's pretty good. So that's a competition you might wanna join because if you're in Korea, of course. Sure. Yeah, and, yeah, and it's quite easy. So it's cheap. Oh, yeah. That's expensive, right? So it bucks? turns out crystals do work with just a normal grits and with oh, as sloppy process as this. A beaker, a glass bar. That's it. And some string. That's not string. You can melt it. So or as simple as that. Yeah, it's as, as simple as that. So if you can do it, you guys can do it too. See you next time. Okay.